A stadium alive with atmosphere and two teams ready to commit themselves to excellence for 90 captivating minutes. We're privileged to be here on an occasion that resonates with football fans everywhere. The floodlights are shining down on the players here at Old Trafford in Manchester. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And there are a few more enjoyable days on the football calendar than opening day in the Premier League. It's Manchester United versus Wolverhampton Wanderers. Crossing into the middle, and not the best clearance. Casemiro. Not a promising looking attack, but comes to nothing in the end. Later to the box. Emphasis on the clearance, a good one. Can he give them the lead? And a goal! They start as they mean to continue. They make the opening statement. And taking it away. Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. Perfect tackle. Scott McTominay. It's a fine United move in the making. Well, it's a textbook example of dynamic passing. Well, the fans want to see a shot. Very quick thinking there. Might be onto something with that ball. Uh, nothing tight about that decision. Offside all the way. Really showing off his wide range of passing skills. Managed to get it out of there. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Doyle here's Luke Shaw and a good looking ball oh thwarted there and what a piece of defending we've just witnessed that is how to apply the pressure that's a very fine piece of tackling. Options in the centre. United might be able to cash in. And the cross into the middle. Well cleared away. Nice weight on the pass. That was going in. And maybe scope for United to add to their advantage with this set piece. And he's fired over the corner. Oh, splendid header, but a fine save. Well, another corner following on from the last one. And the danger's still on. Oh, a tremendous block. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Electing to shoot and diving to thwart him. Well, the crowd are willing them to score here. They've created so many chances. Good clearance. And so the ref. Second half underway with United looking to build upon a largely positive first half showing. Great vision to switch the play. A tremendous vision. The cross is on. And a super header. It looked as though it might be going in. And they're making a change. Still not clear. Bruno Fernandes. Oh, tremendous goal! Technical excellence to finish that one off. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire.
Well, using the space really well, you've got to say. Shaw. Fernandes. Nicely blocked. And over the touchline for what will be a Wolves throw. And a substitution in the offing. Mateus Cunha. Well, a change of scenery to tell you about. Transfer business concluded. Morata has completed his move to Aston Villa. Well, it's an exciting transfer, isn't it? He'll add a lot of quality to his new club, and you'd expect him to have an impact straight away. Good player and fair value for him, I think. Now, options are plenty. And he's through here. And there it is! Still life left in this game. And they have the momentum now. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the score. What's going to happen next? Now we're inside the final 15 minutes. Went in strongly, decisively. Well, United, I think, deserve to be in front. They need to see this through, though. But what backing they're getting from these fans. The atmosphere is electric. Pretty straightforward in the end. Mateus Cunha. And he's won the ball. Plenty of support here. Advantage, Manchester United. This could be it! Oh, just mistimed his run, and the flag going up. Oh, the keeper needed to do an awful lot better. And there it is, the full-time whistle, a victory for Manchester United. Yeah, it was a good result. They played well and they're now up and running. That's just what they wanted. We simply have to focus on this man. Three goals in three games, and you can't argue with that. Hello, everyone. It's an ideal day for football here in London at the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium. My name is Derek Ray, and my commentary partner on this occasion is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It is Tottenham Hotspur versus Manchester United. Well, that was a good result on match day one for United. They played some attractive football, they looked fit, and they fully deserved the three points. Can they repeat that today? Let's hope so. Who can he pick out? And that was goalkeeping right out of the top drawer. It's absolutely remarkable. His reflexes were brilliant there. Delivering it. Appeared to be in two minds. Trying his luck. And a goal! Not bad for starters. They take an early lead. And so the action continues. Will there be a response from Tottenham now? There needs to be. Scott McTominay. And Javier with it. 
And with that, the attack fizzles out. Potentially freedom for United on the flank. And delivered into the box. And it's in for Manchester United. They are on a victory course. Bentancourt. Bruno Fernandes has it. Back to Fernandes. It should be. Keeper did his job to begin with. Well, he tried to place it, but off the frame of the goal. Yes, he's hit the woodwork, but really from that distance, he should be tucking that away. Intercepted effortlessly. opportunity still could be dangerous and I'll tell you what that looked like a certain goal had to be a goal well that was a golden opportunity he has to score there here's Luke Shaw Shaw well a joy to watch and made sure the pass wasn't troublesome. The outcome is a goal kick here. No let up on the pressing front. Saar. Werner. the conclusion he's missed the opportunity well half time almost upon us and playing away from home isn't bothering them in the slightest Stuart how about your take yeah they're playing really well here they've controlled the flow of the game they've won their individual battles and they've created numerous chances their only problem in the second half could be complacency but I can't see that happening no more time So the second half is underway, and I'll tell you what, Spurs know they really need to lift themselves. And he's made headway. And it's got to be. And the post getting in the way. And still dangerous. And options in the centre. Well, the ball brought down under no real pressure. Well, I can't believe that didn't go in. So close to finishing this game off. Well, there's been quite a lot of talk on the Everton front in recent days, and they have the new signing finally confirmed, Stuart. Well, considering the current market, this has to be a real bargain. He's such a top player, and he will certainly improve their performances. And a change for Spurs at this juncture. This looks more than decent. Oh, surely! And still danger here. It was on its way in. Well, it was a chance for them to get back into this one, but they were denied by a great piece of goalkeeping, you have to say. It is a decent-looking attack here. Good-looking cross. Well, not the best clearance. Happy to take on the shot. Well, not the easiest of saves, but you'd expect him to stop it. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. Well, I have to say, United have been a joy to watch today. Just look oh, at Oh, they them. could put it away, Stuart. Denied by the bar. Back in play here. Well, no way through in the end. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Oh, what an opportunity! A goal! That's two for him today! They simply can't stop him! No wonder he's celebrating! 
Is this going to be a thrashing? 3-0 now. Rebier. Son. Chance for Son. Oh dear. Not a great effort, was it? Here's a change for Manchester United. Casemiro. Good pass. Can they take advantage? Tremendous block. Has a go. A smart stop here. Who can they pick out? Crucial piece of defending. Now the counter-attack looks on. And we are going to have two additional minutes. Well, no stopping him. And making his move inside. Well, what a stop it was. Well, I have to say, that's a magnificent save. That's a top-class piece of goalkeeping. Well, not cleared away completely. And there it is, the final whistle. It's a Manchester United victory.